Hello everyone. Today we are visiting Malapascua Island on the Philippines. This tiny island paradise is located just off the northern tip of Cebu, in the heart of this spectacular island nation. It's no big surprise that Malapascua is almost all about diving, and there really is some spectacular diving here. We will get to that a little bit later, so keep watching. Before we get to that, we have to explore the beautiful beaches. There is a beach for everyone's taste here. Our favorite is Lango Beach, which is located on the north side of the island. But wait. Getting to Langup can be an adventure of its own. Sure, you can get on a local taxi, but the best option is to walk through the jungle part of the island, even if it can be a little bit exhausting in the heat. However, when you get there, it is like walking straight into heaven. So why is this particular beach so special? Well, there are several reasons for that. The sand and the crystal clear water help, of course. But the main thing is that it is so peaceful, it is really secluded without the big crowds. Just staying here and experience this beautiful spot is enough for us. And since the main part of town is on the southern tip of the island, you can basically have it all to yourself. It really is like a dream. we will get to the diving. Don't worry, just keep watching. Before we do, we need to get some lunch. The best place on this island is a small burger shack next to the pier. It is not really clear what the name is, but the food and atmosphere beats everything else. It's pretty simple. Having a 90 cents homemade cheeseburger is not bad at all. Okay, so we are getting there. We are going to get out and into the ocean for some scuba diving. We just need to find the dive shop, but it is very, very easy to get lost even on the smallest island in the world. We are finally here. We picked Jack and his crew at Atlas Divers as our guides under the sea. The same way how I check your air, so the same way how you signal me 100, 120, this is 90, 80, 70 bar will be our low on air. So we'll be expecting again to see the treasure sharks. And um, once we see the treasure sharks, um, we'll just stay where we are. Have you ever seen a shark? Please let us know in the comments below. Pretty amazing, isn't it? Your afternoon, or after dive as we should call it, is best spent on the south side of the island at Bounty Beach. There are quite a few places here where you can have a drink and just relax while showing off your underwater shots. You will have plenty of them, that's guaranteed. This is the perfect spot to wait for the sunset. And what a sunset to watch. This kind of tells us that life is not bad at all. Did you subscribe already? Please do, we have a lot more fantastic destinations coming up. This is just the start of this trip and we want you to join us. The next clip is ready for you now. Please leave a comment and tell us what you think about our videos. Thank you for watching, it means a lot to us.